Cody. YouTube, what's going on today, guys? This is Girl Dad Cards. Hi, I'm Lily. And I've got my co-host, Miss Lily, back. And we did something pretty fun this past weekend, didn't we? What did we do? We went to a card store and a card shop. We did. We went to a card show, right? It was your very first card show where we picked up some pretty fun things. And that's what we're going to show you guys in this video. And then we went to a card store. If you guys live anywhere close to Atlanta or are planning on traveling to Atlanta, make sure you take a look at Cards HQ. Yes, that is Jeff Wilson's spot, the famous uh, sports card investor, quote unquote. Um, they've got a beautiful, beautiful store, lots of wax, lots of singles, um, places to break, right? Lots of awesome things, and they're constantly buying. So uh, we went in there, sold a few cards, bought some wax, and, and Lily laid on the couch that they have that's set up in front of some TVs. So uh, like we said, we went to our, or we went to Lily's first card show, and I went to my first card show in about 20 years, and we picked up some cool things. So what do you think? We show them what you, uh, what you got at the card show? Yeah. So remind these awesome subscribers and folks watching what it is that you were looking for. I was looking for an Eevee card, and mm. surprisingly, I found an Eevee card, and I found a statue of Eevee. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, Dad doesn't know very much about Pokemon, Eevee? but you guys tell us, what do we think? How would we do? We actually got this from I'll free or for free from a seller uh, since it's for Lily's e -E PC. E -E. Yep, that's how you spell it. So we're going to put this with her original. E -E -E -E. Yep. E -E -E. yep, her original Eevee from uh, from the first set that's come that uh, came out back in the late 90s. So that's what Lily got. And she also got. A pretty cool Funko Pop of Eevee, Eevee right? That Eevee. you have been walking around with since, Eevee. right? So that's pretty cool. Eevee. Uh, after that, my game plan Eevee. was to trade a few cards, sell a few cards, and Eevee. buy some wax for the channel. So, I love you all, Eevee. Uh, we did that. Um, I know Lily was a little bored because it took a lot of time, right? Yes. But you were definitely a trooper as dad was wheeling and dealing with some folks. So I was bored. The, I realized actually the only card that I actually bought, uh, which was pretty surprising, I know I sold a few and um, whatnot, was actually this, a 2022 Prism No Huddle, uh, rookie variation of my boy Sam Howell in a mint nine. I'm still a believer in Sam, even though he no longer plays for the Commanders. I think it's only a matter of time before he takes over for Geno Smith out there in Seattle. And he's definitely still part of my PC. You know, he's a uh, North Carolina quarterback, similar to Drake May. So love those guys. have been a Carolina fan since I was uh, a little, little dude. Uh, pretty much since I was Lily's age. So um, that was actually the only card I picked up. There was a few other singles that just weren't the right price for me. But we did get some wax as well. And what I decided to pick up was this 2022 Bowman Chrome Mega Box. Uh, I plan on doing a little bit of J-Rod, Bobby Witt, and uh, CJ Abrams hunting, right? So that was really cool. Um, spoke with a lot of folks, mm -hmm. sold a couple cards. Um, it wasn't a huge show, maybe, I don't know, 25-ish tables, mm -hmm. um, something like that, 25-ish vendors. Uh, but it was definitely a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. um, and then, like I said, mm -hmm. we decided to go to Cards HQ after, and we sold a few more cards. Mm -hmm. And we decided that we wanted to pick up some more wax, right, to open. So after we pulled this banger the other day, yes, this Aaron Judge, uh, 2022, auto. Allen and Ginter auto numbered. Well, it was also a mini. Yep, 
numbered that's cool 25 out of 25 right you guys might have seen our uh our short of that the other day yeah. we decided we wanted to buy some more allen and ginter because what do you love out of these these boxes Minis. you love the minis right so we can ended up can i open like the pack we're not going to open up any of these packs today. We're going to save these for another day and maybe do some like shorts and whatnot. But we got a 2023 Allen and Ginter uh, hobby box. Uh, it was actually a really good price as well. It was only 110. Um, those things are on Dave Adams for for about 125 right now or 120, and I think uh, Steel City is about 125. So not bad. Um, Got that basically on store credit for some of the cards that I sold to them uh, and then got a little bit of cash back as well. So I think we did pretty good, you know, 110 for this. Uh, I don't know if I said this, but this was for sale for uh, 50, 59. Yeah, 59. And those are running for about 65 on Dave and Adam. So uh, we'll take it about the same, you know, as, as, uh, you know, comps are a little bit cheaper. So uh, we decided though that we didn't want to just make this video about the pickups that we got, right? Like while these things are really cool, we did decide we, we wanted to open some Lorcana, right? Since we just found out that Lorcana has a new set coming out in what? I think 10 days? Yeah, 10 days on the, on the 17th. So we're very excited about that. I um, will definitely be ripping some of that for the channel. So let's uh, crack into these, right? Yeah, you're definitely gonna open, definitely gonna open these packs. So, you know, definitely excited. Uh, do we need to tell it, these folks anything? Hit that like button down below and subscribe to our channel. Don't yep. hit too hard. Yep, don't hit too hard. If you're still watching, we appreciate it. Uh, and if you guys could, you know, like and subscribe, that'd be great. Uh, we will be doing, you know, some of these openings here before too long. Still looking to pick up some optic. Unfortunately, haven't been able to get any of that. It's been pretty, pretty slim pickings, but uh, only a matter of time. Got to keep, got to keep on keeping on, right? So Lily is gonna open this and she's gonna show you guys what we got. We've got three packs of Lorcana as I put a couple of these away in my PC. I'm waiting for you. Oh, you're okay. You can go ahead, babe. So why don't you tell the folks what we got? Well, there's one that I don't know. That's okay. So what do we got? We got uh, Zazu, okay. Oh, I don't know if I've seen this one. Lena Sabruing. Grandma, Grandma Tala. Tala. Yeah. Oh, is this one of the locations? That's uh, Nottingham. This is from um, Robin Hood. Stitch. Oh, that's a cool stitch. I think Stitch might be at Disney World. Yeah, you think so? Well, we'll see. Mr. Swoops, don't know who that is. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, that's cool. Look. It's called Sumerian Talisman. I think that means at the bottom, that means it's a rare card. What we got there? Well, I think this is a real card too. That's, yeah, that's Dewey. Here's another rare card. Yeah. That's Ooh, Simba. Ooh, this seems good. Look. Ooh, friend like me. That's the genie. That would be a cool card friend to get signed like if he's there. Genie. Another genie. Okay, I don't know this one. And that is Flint Heart Glomgold, and that is a hollow. So Why do people keep, people keep sending us trash cards? Well, those are so you can figure out how to play the game. You know, our friend Miss Sam likes to play the game, right? I want to try to play the game. Uh, yeah, you're going to have to figure out how to play the game with somebody else because I don't know how to play. Miss Sam. Yeah, maybe Miss Sam can help you out. All right. Let's rip this pack. I was supposed to rip it. There you go. I was supposed to rip it. 
your fun to start it. Mm hmm but So what else we got? Who's that? Iago? No. Okay. We have that card. Mm -hmm. Oh, and we also have this card. Made Marion. We also have this card. Gizmo suit. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We don't have this one. Werby Vanderquack. Interesting. We don't have this one. Milo Thatch. Oh, he's from Treasure Treasure Planet. That's a good good movie. We have this one. Cleansing Rainwater from Raya, I believe. We have this one. Sorcerer's Tower. Yeah. So I think that's actually uncommon. That's what that one means. We Ooh, who's have that? This one, Pluto. Mm-hmm. We should put that somewhere. We have this one. Cusco's Palace. That's pretty cool. We don't have that one. What's that? Magica Dispel? Don't I, don't know what that is. I forgot this one. Uh, Shenzi. Okay, he's from Lion King. And then the Bayou, and that's our hollow for that. More instructions. Maybe one day we'll get a Enchanted. Maybe one day. <laughs> All right, and we're on our last pack, and this is the oldest one. This is the Rise of the Floodborne. This is the rising floodborne. Yep. That it is. There you go. Has it, when has it been around? Uh, just only about a year. Let's see, what do we got? Jiminy Cricket. Ooh, Mulan, that's cool. We'll have to see if she's at the Donald. At Disney. Yep, Donald. Wait, I think, I think this might be from Robin Hood. Nope, that's from Bos that's Basel from the Great Mouse Detective. Hold still. Yep, hold still. Let the storm rage on. That's uh who is that? Elsa? Yeah. Bell. Oh, Bell again. Yeah. Uh Fairy, Fairy Godmother. Bell. Oh, I think you might like this card because... Mm, yep. It's Hercules, zero to hero. Ooh, this is surprising. Look. Yep, that's a rare one. That's Goofy. Oh, there's another rare one coming up. That is Grand Pobby. And Fairy Godmother is our hollow, so... We got Another puzzle piece. Yep, we did. So we that's it. Can, we already filled that in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So that's it. That is uh, the opening. That's what we picked up from the card show. We'll be going to a couple more in the future and uh, really doing some hunting. So we appreciate you guys uh, for tuning in and, and watching our video and subscribing and you know, just being part of our community. We really appreciate it. So uh, you guys take care of yourselves and we'll see you soon.